students from various institutions gathered at Church Square in Swanee to march to the Union buildings and hand over a memorandum demanding for free decolonized quality education. We have every intention to make sure that there is no damage to property or to any person whatsoever. But to Union building we are going. We are going to register our demand for free education for all now. We are going to register our demands for an end to our sourcing, uh, for decent minimum wages for the workers. And we are saying we demand an end to repression uh, in our universities, victimization of student leaders, um, um, which we believe has been a main factor fueling the violence in universities. There is no way out of a genuine and legitimate demand for free education for all and now. Government has to respond. Government has to engage students. Swani Metro Police spokesperson Isaac Mahamba said even though students were denied permission to march, they will allow them to do so on condition it remains peaceful. What's going to happen now, if they continue with the march, we'll allow them, but we will go to the nearest police station and open a case of puppy violence. Should anything goes wrong, the organizers of the march, they'll be held accountable. More students joined the protest march en route to the union buildings, with various student leaders calling for free education now. We want free education now, and we're not going to be intimidated by the police. All students that are here now who are saying, that they must release our fellow students. We are not living here if they don't release our fellow students. Yeah. Comrade, let me tell you something. The situation now is abnormal. And when the situation is abnormal, we must also react in an abnormal manner. Yeah. A heavy police presence accompanied the students. But tensions flared when an unknown representative arrived to accept the memorandum. Police eventually used stun grenades to disperse the students who were throwing objects at the police. Kotato Mukhale, Eyewitness News.